This morning, the discovery under sea of a large section of the space shuttle Challenger, which exploded more than three decades ago. So what do you think this is, Jim? Definitely an aircraft. I think we need to talk to NASA. Divers for a History Channel documentary found the piece while searching for World War II wreckage near Cape Canaveral, Florida. NASA confirmed it is part of the shuttle, which broke apart shortly after liftoff in 1986, killing all seven on board. The discovery of this piece was mixed emotions. First, we reflected back to 1986 and the loss of our colleagues, our friends, and our heroes. Um, but it also is a sense of discovery. The piece is estimated to be at least 15 by 15 feet. But since some of it is buried under the sand, its true size isn't clear yet. It is one of the biggest pieces of Challenger found since the accident. The first recovered since a left wing washed ashore in 1996. So far, about 47% of the entire shuttle has been recovered. It looks like they're deteriorating. It was determined Challenger was brought down by seals in the right booster, which eroded due to the cold temperatures on launch day. Six astronauts and teacher Krista McCullough were killed. NASA says it will now determine how to safely remove this wreckage and learn from it for future missions. The hard sacrifice that was made by the crews of Space Shuttle Challenger in Columbia will now be shared with people in the future. The family of the seven crew members killed have been notified of the discovery and have asked for privacy. The History Channel documentary airs November 22nd. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.